Hi everyone, here we've got Realme X2 Pro and let me share with you how to change navigation buttons which are right here to the gestures. So a very quick reminder, this button is responsible for getting back this to getting back to the home page and this one opens the recents so uh, after it we can go directly uh, to the um, to the settings which will allow us to change into the gestures so let's tap on the settings and here we have to find the uh, convenience um, tools so let's tap on it and as you can see here we've got navigation buttons so let's enter and here we've got actually quite a lot of options which we can choose right now we've got virtual buttons and this option is applied and obviously you can select your preferred key layout so you can change the position of the keys actually you can change the position of the recent and the back button uh, here you've got also the option to auto hide uh, virtual buttons so probably I uh, I suppose that for example, whilst opening the keyboard or something, then the navigation buttons will uh, disappear. Uh, what's more, here we've got swipe gestures uh, from both sides. And this is the very first option which we can choose if you'd like to set the gestures. So let's tap on it. And as you can see here, we've got the info, here we've got the preview. So we will be able to, to use the back button and you can do it uh, swiping from the edge to the... Uh, to the how is it called to the middle of the screen if you'd like to get back to the home page just swipe it up and if you'd like to open the recents then you have to swipe and hold it somewhere here here we've got also the mistouch prevention from uh, for swipe gestures from both sides and this option is activated so when using full screen into landscape mode uh, gestures needs two swipes to take effect uh, so this is the very first option uh, connected with gesture so of course you can set it uh, right now and leave it because as you can see it has been also immediately applied you cannot see any buttons but we can also tap on more and here we've got another two options which we can use and it's not uh, it's not very usual, uh, I would say. And as you can see here, we've got two button navigation. So after tapping on it, we can check that here we will have the buttons, which let's say we had previously, but uh, we've got only two of them. So the back button and the home page, I suppose. And we can tap on swipe up gestures. And here actually we've got the areas uh, which uh, will be responsible for some uh, actions so as you can see we can swipe up to go back swipe up in the middle uh, to uh, go to the home screen and swipe up and pause to view uh, the recent tasks so uh, actually that's quite strange option i mean i've never uh, seen something like that before so uh, of course you can set this option uh, it's really up to you but i think i will stick with uh, this option so from both sides and as you can see it is immediately activated so now you can check if it is working and uh, let's go back to the home page by swiping just like that and as you can see it works let's open something in order to to get back uh, just by swiping from the edge to the uh, middle and the same situation it works so uh, now let's open the recents and you can do it by swiping up very gently and hold it somewhere here and here we've got the recent tasks so actually that's all this is how to uh, this is how to set the gestures in your realme x2 pro thank you so much for watching i hope that this video was helpful and if it was please hit the subscribe button and leave the thumbs up